This is where we stopped. Under the great arch. By the river. In the distance, another fire is burning at the entrance of the cave. Here we are. Listen. Don't move, just observe him. He is the cave bear. You have seen him in your dreams. You are now in his home. The skull of one of his brothers was placed here some time ago. Here too we left our mark. Look around you. You're close. Here, one of us scraped the clay, revealed the limestone and gave it shape. The mammoth was always here in the stone. The artist felt its presence. He brought it to life so that we could bear witness. Look. Before you lies humanity's first masterpiece. A fresco so massive, we can hardly see all of it at once. We can see horses. One of them expresses fear. Another is playing, and the last has pricked up his ears in curiosity. On the left, Aurochs struggle to escape from the wall. Here, furry rhinoceroses are clashing in a battle of titans. Have you seen the cave lions? The lioness threatening the male. At the other end of the wall, reindeers and stags are running away. Here again, the artist uses the relief of the rock wall to reveal its shapes. We are attentive to their every movement, to their every breath. 
the very essence of these creatures has been captured. By people who were chosen to go into the cave and to bring our beliefs to life by drawing them. The animals we've hunted, eaten, whose skins and furs we've used for clothing. We have observed them for a long time. recreating them in our sanctuary so that they will continue to exist forever. It's your turn to touch the wall of the cave. It was here that our paths crossed. It was here that we met one another. The flow of this river, of this uneven ground, of this unique, recognizable, inevitable mineral arch, all conspire to bring us together, to unite us. From north, east, south, and west, men, women, and children all gathered here. And here they left their trace, the trace that leads to you.